Now, let's use the Layout Designer to further customize our new company invoice. Click here on Layout Designer. Here from within the Layout Designer, we can further customize our invoice. Let's come down to the bottom of the invoice and let's see the fields that we added. When we add fields, they're going to appear at the bottom first. So now we're going to want to drag these up to the top. Let's grab our phone by clicking with our left mouse button and holding down and then releasing where we want it to appear. Facts. Where should we put the facts? Let's put it here for now. Let's move phone over here. Like that. And let's put facts here. That'll look good. Let's move. Now we have our phone and facts there. Let's go back down to the bottom. Let's move all four of these by selecting them like this. And let's put them here. Here we added this text field. Let's change the font. Click on the field and come up here and click on properties. Here, let's click on font and let's make this 16 point bold. Click OK. And now we have a, our message, our text message, down at the bottom. Let's come up here a little bit further. And this column. We never have enough room for description, so we're going to move this column over simply by clicking on it and dragging. Now we have a little bit more space in this column. Finally, let's make sure that this invoice will show up in a window envelope. Let's come over here and click on Show, Win show Envelope Window. Now you can see right where a window envelope will appear. We may want to move this one over a little bit. Right there. No, let's bring it this way a ways. There. That'll show up nicely right within the window envelope. Now, once we've completed all of our changes here in the Layout Designer, simply click on OK, and that's going to save this custom invoice. Now we're ready to save our new invoice. Simply click on OK, and here it is. Here's our company invoice that we've just created. Let's look at it on the screen. Let's click on Open Form and let's click on Preview. And here is how our new form looks. Let's zoom in a little bit and you can see how we may want to come back and clean this up a little bit more. Let's go down to the bottom. Here's our email and website and our text message at the bottom. And that's how to customize an invoice.